I am for sure, so CCM. Sorry. Just swapped out the microphone, you broke. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, GQ Sports? I'm Connor McDavid, and these are my essentials. BioSteel, this is their pre-workout. I have it before every game and during every game. It gives you a little extra boost. There's no sugar, which, uh, which is nice. Your daily vitamins. This is collagen, vitamin C that I take as well. They have a ton of different flavors. This is their original flavor. I don't even know what you would call it. I'm still an original guy. I think they nailed it the first time. The OG uh, BioSteel pre-workout. Uh, nice. Speaking of working out, the UB 20s. Been with Adidas now for a couple years. You know, I got to work out, and, and I like to live an active life, so these help me do that. Are you a big sneaker guy, big sneakerhead, or no? Just ever since I've been with with Adidas, I've kind of become one, just because they're constantly sending me new shoes. I got a closet full of shoes for sure, but I'm not the craziest one, that's for sure. Sorry. My CCM stick. This one's pretty obvious. This is what I do every day. This is my life, so. If I don't have my tools to work, then I can't play hockey, so this is pretty important to me. Why do you guys tape the bottom of the stick and why do you tape the top? You tape the bottom for, you know, puck control, um, and then you tape the top just for grip, a little extra grip. I've seen some of the craziest things with guys in their stick. I play with uh, Leon Dreisaitl, who uses pretty much a canoe paddle for, for a stick. I've seen guys do just about anything with, uh, with their hockey stick. My next essential would be the 11T Parka. A nice warm jacket is obviously essential for cold Canadian winters. Living in Edmonton, playing hockey in Edmonton, it's a little bit cold. Actually, last week it was the coldest place on the planet, literally. That's not uh, an exaggeration. I've worked with 11T a couple times. They've helped me out with you know, red carpets and stuff like that, all-star games or at the awards. and They just have a little bit of a different, unique style and something that, that I like. My next essential would be uh, the Apple AirPods. Pretty self-explanatory, I mean, we're on the road a lot. Music on the bus or music on the plane is essential, and if you don't have much space, those can fit just about anywhere, so yeah, definitely important. What's on Connor's pre-game playlist? Uh, you know, I'm not someone that wears the headphones into the rink. Usually like to, to interact with the guys and talk to the guys before the game, and I usually just listen to music on downtime or to kill time. My next essential is the Apple phone. Everyone these days lives on their phone and it helps you stay connected. Being on the road, you know, you have people to talk to, friends and family, it uh, makes it easy. What's your favorite app on your iPhone? I guess the NHL, NHL app, you know, just keeping up with the scores. You have to pay attention all the time. I mean, in our division, we're in a tight race. You know, every night matters, so you know, we're seeing what, uh, what those teams are doing. Black licorice. This is one of my favorites, so you know, I've got a bit of a sweet tooth, and uh, that's what I choose. I remember being a kid, and if we, we'd go and rent a movie and get a bag of licorice, and that was our thing. I don't know. It's kind of just stuck with me. Can you describe the taste of licorice? Yeah, just it tastes like licorice. That's uh, the only way you can describe it, really. <laughs> Another central are the, the sunglasses in Edmonton with, uh, with all the snow. Can be pretty bright. A lot of people don't know that Edmonton actually gets a lot of sun. These are uh, Ray-Bans. A funny story about these sunglasses have never left me. I've lost them probably numerous times at concerts, dropped them on the ground, and you know, I thought that was you know, the end of them, and someone actually brought them back to me an hour later. I had them stolen out of my car, found them in the grass a couple weeks later, so these will never leave me. Another essential would be probably my dog. I just got him. He's just a puppy still. He's a miniature Bernadoodle. Name's Lenny. There's no real meaning behind it at all. Honestly, I just thought it was funny. Just looks like a Lenny, huh? Cute little guy. Keeps me going for sure. He doesn't care if you have a good game or bad game. He just wants to love you anyway, so definitely essential. My last essential would be the, the CIBC Visa card. I mean, this one's another pretty self-explanatory thing. You pay for stuff and pay for groceries. Has it been tapped in Canada yet? We got the tap, yeah. I think uh, most Americans think that uh, Canada, we just live in igloos, and we just walk around, it's just snow everywhere. And, but uh, no, we have the tap, and we got some technology. Cool, thanks for clearing that up. That's, awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. These are my essentials, and uh, I'll see you on the ice.